Hello students, welcome back to our class that is population interactions where we are studying about interaction between different species and different types of interactions. Now let us see what is mutualism. When two species are interacting, if the relationship is benefit for both of them, it is called mutualism. Such type of mutualism we see in plants and animals. Animals that is birds and bees depend on plants for the food material. And plants also depend on birds and bees for pollination. Even for seed dispersal, plants depend on animals. And animals are getting food from the plants. So plants and animals are in relationship with each other. And both of them are getting benefit which is called as mutualism. And for this we can see some more examples. The first one is fig, fig tree. Where we can see fruits of figs which are used by the wasp for oviposition. That means to lay the eggs. These are the wasp, wasp which is laying eggs in the fig fruit. So, fig fruit is giving shelter and also it gives food to the developing larvae. And what is the benefit the wasp is giving to the fig tree? It means it is helping in pollination. So, plant is helped by the wasp for pollination and wasp is getting benefit as shelter and also food for the developing land. And another example we can see here is orchids, Mediterranean orchids. These orchids, then one of these orchids that is Ophrys, we can come across sexual disease. That is one of the petals of these flowers, Ophrys flowers resembles one, a specific type of female bees. So when female Bees are resembling the flowers, petals of this plant. What happens? The male bees comes in search of female bees and pseudo populates the flower. So because of this, what happens? The plant is getting pollination. So pollination is done because of the bees which are coming in search of male bees are coming in search of female bees. So here we can see mutualism, both are benefited. And this type of relationships, they result in co-evolution. We can see such type of mutualism in lichens, where we can see the association between fungus and algae and also mycorrhiza, where we can see rhizobium bacteria and leguminous plants, both are benefited. So such type of relationship is called as mutualism where both the uh, organisms which are in relationship are getting benefit from each other. So this is about mutualism. We can uh, conclude our lesson in the next two videos.